Well, hello everybody, Mr. O here, and welcome to my first unboxing video. I have a very big special thanks uh, going out to the sender of this box. It's XP Pen, and they don't even know I'm making this video for a YouTube channel, but I appreciate what they did so much. These are prizes that we are giving away this summer for an XP Pen Mr. O Art School contest um, with digital art. So let's see what's in the box. This is amazing. So instead of sending us three tablets, they sent five. They were so impressed with the digital art they got from the middle school and high school students. Uh, they sent extra tablets. We were, we were thinking three and we got five and they're the Deco Fun L, a pen tablet, pretty good size and the Deco One V2 and the Deco Mini 4 there. Um, I think these students are going to be incredibly happy and um, I will share with you guys the artwork at the end of this video and for other people part of my YouTube channel um, as you know I do what I can to get stuff um, and give it out and XP pen in my classroom has been a big supporter and um, let me, I can show you what they've sent me to just try out with students and work with students. And um, um, I could do an individual video showing you guys how each device works. Um, let me know in the comments if that's something you want. But let me just share the devices they did send me, the ones that are opened up. I can, and I can t tell you a little bit about them. All right, guys, so this is gonna be a quick overview. Uh, the tablets I'm gonna share with you are the ones they sent to me at school, ones I got to try out, ones I got to use with students. And I'm gonna share with you some of the student comments and my own thoughts. Uh, this is the Deco Mini 7, and one of the biggest things um, that I have really liked with XP Pen, and guys, for my students, even for myself, um, uh, especially when it comes to money, as you can probably guess, when you have an art room and you, you work in a low uh, economic area, you don't have money to buy the supplies you really want. Digital art gets pushed to the wayside because of the expense. So I would buy Wacom tablets, Wacom tablets, tomato, tomato. Um, online and stuff and they did not work in every Chromebook we have as a district it seemed like every year we we're changing the kinds of Chromebooks we we have like six or seven different kinds of Chromebooks that we use and what made XP pen superior was they I could plug this into any of the Chromebooks and it instantly worked there was no issues and what made this one uh, even more exciting, which is the Deco Mini, Mini 7, what made this one even more exciting is the shortcut buttons worked. I didn't think that could uh, work in the Chromebook. And what's really nice too, and let me go to the next one, is the, the Deco S um, can work in cell phone and tablets. We tried it out. Um, I haven't tried this one in my cell phone, so I, I, I won't speak too much. Uh, and like I said, this one is the Deco Fun S. Um, I was like, oh, this is a little thicker and stuff. But when you put it with a cell phone, it just seems like the angle is just perfect. Um, it, what the one I'm probably the most excited about is probably the the least expensive, uh, and that's the Star G six seventy. If you're somebody who is, especially if you're still in school, um, no matter what part of the world, uh, I really recommend this Star G640. There's several reasons. One, if, if you're just trying it out, I think people get caught up on the shortcut buttons. There's no shortcut buttons, but this thing is like a thick, heavy plastic. 
and it does well. Um, I don't know if this is going to come through the video very well. Uh, as you can see, I have a Chromebook bag here. As you can see, Chromebook bags aren't very big, but you put your Chromebook in there. This thing will slide, and I usually keep, uh, looks like I lost my little covering thing for it. Uh, usually I keep a, a, the little sleeve on top and protect it, and if you keep that sleeve that it comes in, and just slide your uh, slide it right in the Chromebook bag, and keep your wire, always unplug your wire so you don't uh, lose connection. The only concern when I first got this stuff was the pen itself. Um, when I first like picked it up, because like I said, I, I, I use Wacom and, and stuff like that, and so I know what it's supposed to feel like. I was a little worried because it didn't seem to have the weight, but guys, let me tell you, I'm not just telling you stuff because XP Pen sent this stuff to me, and I, I truly believe this. I will always be honest with you guys. Um, it works very well. Um, that this little star, let me pull it out again, G640, 1800 point of pressure. And you, you can't beat that for 40 bucks. Uh, it's sell price is 40 bucks where I was trying to get these for students and the cheapest I could find was a hundred bucks and it didn't work in all the Chromebooks. XP Pen, this is a message to you. I can't thank you enough. Um, I know this is a, probably a video you guys weren't expecting me to do, um, but I, I cannot tell you how appreciative uh, we are. And, uh, and the rest of you guys, I know you like my giveaway videos maybe one day. Um, I will collect enough money and I'll purchase some of these things to give away to you guys. But if it's something that you guys want to invest in or move up the model that you do have, I do recommend uh, the XP Pen. Go to their website. Um, you can ask me questions. If you want me to do actual demonstrations, product re like true product reviews on each one of the devices so you can see how I use use it and see the results um, I will do that like I said just leave that in the comments um, but thank you uh, and you know most importantly I cannot forget to do this and and again XP pen thank you the rest of you guys you are important never forget that and uh, we'll see you next video. Okay? Bye-bye.